Hey guys, how's it going? Um, there's a bit of bad news uh, about the tank. Uh, yesterday when I was cleaning out the tank, I think I might have opened the valve from the CO2 a bit too much. And um, so it was fine the whole time and because I didn't have the CO2 open or I didn't have it running for about two days, um, the silicon tubing actually filled up with water. So when I went to open the CO2 again yesterday uh, to start pumping it in, I uh, must have just opened it way too much and it was going fine and then I left the room for about two hours maybe two or three hours came back and all the fish were basically floating um, as you can see they're all fine now or most of them anyway um, but anyway they were all floating and I immediately noticed that the CO2 was just pumping out like crazy so um, basically what happened is they got CO2 poisoning so um, there wasn't enough oxygen in the water and they all started suffocating. Basically, that's what happens. Um, so out of all that, I surprisingly only lost one neon. And um, you can see one of my glass catfish there is, I think, paralyzed. I'm not sure what actually happened with that um, little guy. But we took him out, I think, last. We didn't really notice he was in there because we took all the fish out and then noticed that he was still in there. So he was in there for the longest. Um, so I'm really not sure what to do with him. Um, I just feel really sorry for him. I mean, he's just constantly swimming around in circles. Um, it just looks like half his body is sort of bent. Um, the rest of them are actually okay, uh, which is surprising because I just put them in a bowl with an air stone, so I quickly took out all the fish, just put them in a bucket of uh, fresh tap water um, with the air stone that I have here, the pump and the air stone. Um, and they all recovered pretty quickly and I did a water change on the tank and just had an air stone running in here for a couple of hours as well. Um, so I think most of them are not too bad. I was surprised that I only lost one neon out of all of that because I honestly thought they were all gone. Um, so just a warning to people that are using CO2, uh, always make sure that you don't open the valve. Uh, too much, especially if you haven't had it running for a few days. Uh, the tubes tend to, to fill up with water um, Obviously if you have a check valve, I mean it, it'll, it'll still go down to the check valve, but it won't go through um, But yeah, it just takes a few hours for the water to actually pump out um, So yeah, just a bit of a warning. I guess I've learned from my mistakes now um, But yeah, just a bit of a shame that especially this poor little glass catfish there um, and I think there's actually another one. The other glass catfish turned almost completely white. Um, he was actually the biggest one I have and I can't actually see him anywhere at the moment. So he's either hiding or he's dead and I can't find him. So um, yeah, sorry about the bad news. I mean, it's probably mostly my fault, but um, luckily I could save most of them in time. So anyway, thanks for watching guys. And yeah, just be careful when you're using CO2. Thanks for watching.